Another thing that goes very well with bubbles is brunch. And that's on the menu for today's Valentine's special, Love at First Bite. And if we're not going out to enjoy it, let's make it epic at home. Randy is preparing a German breakfast spread. So here's what you're gonna need. Bread, cheese, jam, jelly, some honey, cold cuts, eggs, tomatoes, cucumbers, fresh juice, and of course coffee because we all need the coffee. Now Randy, I love that you're preparing a deconstructed German breakfast. I think it's the perfect brunch for Valentine's Day weekend. I'm very interested. So my best friend from kindergarten is German and I was at her house all the time and I remember lots of bread and lots of cold cuts and Nutella. That's what, they introduced me to Nutella. Oh, hey, listen, they're not wrong. It's kind of a balance between the breads, the cold cuts, the cheese, the sweets, because it's breakfast time. We've got some, some honey here, and then we've got some jams and jellies as well. But Tracy, it's more of a lifestyle, you know, because mm. right now we're not going anywhere. There's nothing <laughs> to do. So instead of being in a hurry for your breakfast, this allows you to kind of put a giant spread together and then it makes conversation because everyone just kind of comes along and they just graze and away they go, right? And they work away. But the cornerstone, the foundation is the brotchkin, which is the tiny little breads. This, we have this amazing uh, German bakery downtown called Sigrid's and they make the most beautiful bread you've ever seen in your life. This is a multi-grain with sesame flax and sunflower. Mm. Oh my stars, right? So their bread is just untouchable. From there, you're just building things up. So we might get some cold cuts, like some smoked bacon here, a little bit of village ham. This is my favorite thing in the entire world. This is a liner sausage. And I don't know what is in here, but it's kind of <laughs> like, like a really high-end mortadella, like, and it just melts in your mouth like foie gras. Then you're gonna need some cheeses, right? Nice and thinly sliced because you're about building your own and coming around and kind of checking things out. Now, of course, you need the coffee. I mean, you do the press, you can do the drip, you can do whatever you want. Maybe some Prosecco with some fresh orange juice, a little bit of fresh veggies. But now we definitely need some eggs. And Tracy, I need to ask you, how do you like your hard boiled eggs? Oh, that's a good question. So um, I don't want I don't want it to be runny at all, actually. But I don't want it to be hard, hard. Whoa. Somewhere in between runny and hard, hard. Oh. Yeah. Do you know what number you are? No. I'm a ten. There's, that's an important <laughs> question. <laughs> of course, you're a ten. But not in eggs, Tracy. See, I don't know my own blood type, but I know that I'm a number seven egg because. What happens is when you're doing a perfect hard boiled egg, you want to boil the eggs, right? So you bring up the water to boil, you drop the eggs in, you start a timer. At six minutes, you can see this egg right here is six minutes and it is basically oh. the yolk is uncooked, untouched, right? This is seven minutes, right? These are perfect for dipping. But what I did today is I really wanted to show you this as well as, as my big little platform here. I want to show you the difference. So, you ready? Yeah. You're saying that you're not a six minute egg. I don't think so. That's runny, that's got some gam, that's more like a ramen noodle kind of thing. Mm -hmm. This is a seven, right? A little less runny, right? Now, I feel like you might be an eight. Randy, what if it turns out right? I'm actually a you 10? Start, <laughs> you know yourself better than most. <laughs> <laughs> the here, is a nine. I think you might be a nine and a half, ten, Tracy. You might be right. And for a German yeah. breakfast, this is actually kind of perfect. So, this is a perfect bite for me. I take a little bit of bread, right? And then I'm gonna take a little bit of butter, mm -hmm. like this. And then you just take a little bit of the cheese here. Nice. Right? And then my liner sausage like this. And I'm gonna pick myself a quarter of a number eight. Okay. Right? And here we go. So this is my first bite, Trace. That's what I'm going for Beauty. first. Beauty. Beauty. The next bite, I might go a little bit sweeter, mm. where I might go a little bit of the ham, and then I might go a little bit of the jelly, and then, you know, I might have a sip of coffee, and we're gonna stand around and talk a little bit more. But by the fourth or fifth kind of little, like, canopy I put together, you know I'm hitting that chocolate danish. Yes. 
this is a, such a good way to do it because it's leisurely. Go ahead, take your first bite. It's leisurely. You can all do it together as a family. You pick and choose what you want. Mm. If you have kids that only want to snack all day and never want like a, a, a full meal, this is the perfect way to satisfy everyone. Is it good? Unbelievable. You need the quality bread. Other than that, you can kind of clean out your fridge. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. A little bit. And that's nice because it's perfect for a, a weekend kind of thing. I think it's beautiful and I love the idea of this. Now, Randy, could you please ask Miss Catherine to put the camera on the tripod and just come to the kitchen so I can chat with you both right yes, now? I because, I mean, we all know Catherine. Catherine has been part of our family, the City Line family, as soon as we met her. We love her. She wears a gazillion hat. She shoots, she cooks. Um, she's been fantastic with Cass. She's been amazing with you. And so I have heard that you have some wonderful news to share with our City Line family. Randy, what's going on? Um, we not only have buns on the board today, we've got a bun in the oven. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> I'm so happy for you. Congratulations. We sent you a little something Thank you. something. If Thank you've got you. it there, could you actually unwrap it for yeah. us so we can show everybody? Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, did you get that? Open her up, Catherine. We wanted to make sure it was well protected. Oh! oh. City Line expert you. in training! So Yay! <laughs> it's amazing. I love it. Hold it up for us one so more much. time. We are so happy for you. Congratulations to your growing Thank family. You. We love you all, and of course, our growing City Line family.